night sky looked so awesome. Yeah, I can watch it for hours. Me too. Me three. Yeah, I wonder why it's so black in the night. I guess because there's no sun right now. Like there is during the daytime, right, Professor? Yes, you're right. The sun in the daytime makes the sky appear blue. The blue color in the sunlight scatters quickly and easily across the skyline. Professor, there may be no sun right now. But there are so many other stars in the sky. Why don't they make the sky appear blue? Yes! Since the sun is also a star, then shouldn't the other stars also do the trick? Good question. So, why is the night sky not blue, Professor? Unlike the sun, the other stars in the sky are very far away from us so their light does not reach the earth as easily and brightly as the sun. This is why other stars appear like dots of light. And because of how far away they are, they cannot make the sky of the earth as bright blue as the sun does. Right! Do you know why lightning and thunder happen? Because giant gods fight up there with their huge weapons? <laughs> oh no, that's not the reason. When rains are about to start, light and noise happen because the rainy clouds bang into each other. Oh yeah, that sounds like a cool action movie. It sounds frightening. Not cool! Yes, Mouse, you are right. Lightning can be harmful, so it is frightening. A lightning strike can set a house on fire. And if it strikes a person, the current can possibly kill them. Oh! Don't worry, Mouse. We can always take shelter under a tree then. Will that protect us, Professor? Definitely not. Whenever there is lightning, it attacks the tallest object in the field. Trees are generally tall with pointed tips. These make trees easy targets for lightning. So, if you take shelter under a tree when there's lightning, the lightning may strike you instead. So you should never stand under a tree when there's lightning and thunder. Underwater looks so beautiful. Yes, it's so beautiful. But Professor, how do fish breathe underwater? Yes, Professor, how? Well, fish have organs that are able to take oxygen from water. These organs are called gills. Gills are not found in mammals. And humans are also mammals. 
So humans don't have gills? That's right. Humans don't have gills. Humans have lungs. And lungs are not designed to extract oxygen from water. They can only handle air. And that's why humans cannot breathe underwater. I like sunshine, I like light. Living in the greens makes me feel bright. I wonder why rats.